Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of excitement and expectation. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. The lineup we have suggests it's going to be a 4 5 1 formation, Jim. Well, most teams that use this system, Peter, will work it in a, a way where. Yes, they'll have a 4-5-1 shape off the ball and ideally a 4-3-3 shape on it. We often see that 4-1-4-1 shape too and that has an obvious flexibility about it. It's a, it's a popular managerial selection because of that. It's just extremely flexible with all the numbers I've mentioned. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Goalkeepers to play. Maya. Well, it did look promising to start with, but in the end they were thwarted before they could even make it into the final third. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Well, they would seem to be trying to expose the centre of that defence to, to runners. Thanks for some terrific movement. It does, and they may be hit on the break because obviously it requires numbers forward to, to stretch them out. This game is in need of some excitement. It needs help, and it's down to the creative and striking talent to up their game and, and give this crowd something to cheer about. to get it forward quickly and he just whacks it away and they're not going to make any further progress now battles to win it back and that's one way of trying to make things happen there's a few who could follow that example Aimed long and direct. It's a promising ball. It's a goal kick. to the flank there are a few waiting for it is it in this could foot in for the pieces it's in and it's Grunigan who take the lead He was really quick to react to the initial save, and he has his reward. Well, listen, last line of defence, and you don't get it right, then you're paying a visit to your net.
Groningen get themselves into the lead. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but one that still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Well, it hasn't exactly gone to plan so far, but there's no need to panic. There's still plenty of time to get back into this. As always, an early goal would help swing things back in their favour. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. RZ don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back though. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those raking passes just to spread the play. Over to the left. Said, still trailing by one, looking here to take it up a notch after the break. This defence is, is wary about opposition pace, so they're just not getting too tight. Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. They've played it short, puts it into the middle, shot at goal! there to hoof it away. What an adventurous run from a defender. That's what has to be done now, no question about it. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Just has to be done. Dinks one in, boots it to safety. That was one quality pass away from being a very decent chance. Looked very promising. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. It's a great ball. Groningen are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. Forward it goes. RZ are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. That is terrific skill. Yeah, it's safe to say that they just need to manage this to secure the win now. So time is nearly up. One final twist, perhaps. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. Always in the balance, and in the end, one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. Well, the way the manager has stormed down the tunnel lends itself to an almighty telling off for such a, a timid, docile display. So many thanks to Jim Beglin. That's all we have time for.